The N54 engine's popularity extended beyond just tuners as it garnered several prestigious accolades, including multiple Engine of the Year awards and consecutive placements in Ward's 10 Best Engines. This straight-six engine quickly became one of BMW's most beloved engines, with production lasting a decade before it was finally phased out in 2016, with the last units going into the E89Z4. Although BMW introduced the N55 as its successor, many enthusiasts consider the N54 superior, particularly for its tuning potential. The N54 seems like the ideal gasoline engine at first glance. It can easily achieve 30 mpg on the highway and outperform many competitors in performance driving scenarios. However, like many high performance engines, the N54 comes with its own set of complexities. In this guide, we'll explore the true capabilities of this admired yet often temperamental power plant, helping you determine if it's the right choice for your needs. As the first N54 engines hit the streets, they boasted 302 GP and 295 lbf of torque. While this was adequate for daily driving, it seemed modest for a 3-litre, straight-six, twin-turbocharged engine. However, the true appeal of the N54 lies not in its factory output, but in its potential for much higher performance. BMW didn't aim for high power figures with the N54. Though it was produced alongside the naturally aspirated N53, the N54 is primarily based on the previous generation M54. Belonging to the NG6 family, the N54 stands out with its all-aluminum block, unlike other series engines that use an aluminum-magnesium construction. BMW chose their dual Vanos system for the N54, differing from the N52, N53 and N55 engines that utilise the Valvetronic system. The twin-power twin-turbo setup with twin TD03 turbochargers works in parallel to boost three cylinders each, delivering almost no lag and maximum torque from 1,300 revolutions per minute to 4,500 revolutions per minute. This configuration ensures smooth power delivery, unlike the abrupt boost typical of turbo setups. Driving an N54 powered car in its stock form feels like experiencing the continuous torque of a larger naturally aspirated engine rather than the quick boost of a turbocharged one. Additionally, BMW's inclusion of direct injection in the N54 helped prevent detonation issues associated with high compression ratios. Many BMWs eventually benefited from the N54 engine during its decade of service, starting with the E9X series before ceasing production with the 2016 BMW E89Z4. Here's the full list of the BMWs and Alpinas that featured the N54 engine. The BMW N54 engine has received plenty of praise for its ability to reach an impressive 500 GP with minimal upgrades, showcasing its robust performance capabilities. But what about its reliability, 
let's delve into the complexities that have given this seemingly perfect engine a somewhat mixed reputation. The N54's internal components are robust and capable of handling significant power increases. This means that major internal damage is unlikely unless the boost is pushed to extreme levels. However, modern engines come with modern problems and the N54 is no exception. Especially when pushed beyond its factory settings, it tends to exhibit some common reliability issues. One of the most frequent problems with the N54 engine is the failure of the high pressure fuel pump, HPFP. Symptoms include extended cranking times, loss of power under acceleration, random stuttering or stalling, and occasionally the engine not starting at all. BMW acknowledged this flaw and extended the warranty to 10 years or 120,000 miles. If it fails outside of this period, replacing the pump costs around $400 and is relatively easy to do. The N54's stock turbos run at just 8 psi, but they can reliably handle up to 15 psi, and some even push them to 22 psi long term. Many owners experience wastegate rattle, which can occur on both stock and modified engines. This issue is often identified by a rattling sound when lifting off the throttle, and is usually accompanied by the 30FF boost leak error code. If left unaddressed, the turbos may no longer hold boost, leading to underperformance rather than severe damage. Despite several revisions, the N54's fuel injectors are prone to failure, resulting in power loss and misfires. Some models come with a 10-year, 120, 000 mile warranty for this issue, but out-of-warranty replacements can cost up to $1,000 in parts and labour. BMW's choice of an electric water pump for the N54's cooling system instead of a traditional chain or belt-driven pump has led to common failures. These pumps aren't built for longevity and it's recommended to replace them every 60,000, 80,000 miles as part of regular maintenance. Due to the N54's direct fuel injection system, carbon buildup is an expected issue, causing power loss decreased fuel economy and throttle lag. It's recommended to have the carbon buildup removed every 30,000, 40,000 miles, which typically costs between $250, $500 if done by an independent specialist. For high mileage N54 engines, oil pan gasket leaks are becoming more common. Replacing this gasket is challenging because the oil pan is located behind the subframe, requiring substantial labor. Over time, the valve cover gaskets on M54 engines can deteriorate, often evidenced by visible oil on the spark plugs. If there is a crack around cylinders 2 and 3, the valve cover itself may need replacement. Otherwise, replacing the valve cover gasket might solve the issue. Gaskets are inexpensive, but a valve cover replacement can cost around $500. Despite the N54's impressive performance capabilities, its long-term reliability issues can be daunting for potential buyers. While BMW offered generous warranties for many of these problems, most are now expired for vehicles on the used market, so it's wise to budget for potential repairs. High-performance engines, especially modern ones, can be costly to maintain and repair unexpectedly.